Welcome to LabTech Alert Templates training. Alert templates are used by LabTech to configure which alerts are being sent when an alert is triggered by a monitor. In this lesson, we will cover how to add, modify, and delete alert templates. Here in the Control Center, left-click on Dashboard in the toolbar. Left-click on the Management tab. Depending on your resolution, not all tabs may be displayed on the Management tab. We will click on the right arrow to scroll over to get to the Alert Templates tab. Left click on the Alert Templates tab. Here you can see several of the built-in Alert Templates that come with LabTech on initial installation. Left click the New Template button to add a new template. At this point, we can click Add Alerts or Save and Close. Here's the new template that was just added. With that one selected in the list, left-click on New Alert. Here we have the ability to add alerts to this template. I will select Raise an Alert. Anytime we are adding an alert, we need to specify a contact. In this case, I will choose to notify a user or technician. After I have left clicked to select user or technician for the alert contact, I'll left click to click on the drop down and specify which technician will get notified. Left click save. With the same template selected, I can add another alert. Let's say we also want to create a ticket on this one as well. But let's say we only want to generate the ticket if it's a weekday. So I will specify these days of the week. And click Save. Once again, a contact needs to be selected when adding an alert. And click Save. To delete a template, with that template selected, in the grid. We can cl left click on delete templates or we can press the delete key on the keyboard and that template is gone. Let's look into some of the additional alert options within a template. Left click in a template, left click on a template in the top pane to see the alerts associated with this template in the bottom. With an alert selected, click the Edit Alert button. Notice how we also have options to control the time of day when these alerts will be sent. So for example, if you don't want these alerts to be sent after hours, you can modify the time in here accordingly and save. Additionally, if we want to add a script action to the alert, once we click on script, that activates our script field. We can left click on the drop down to specify which script we want to be called as part of this alert action. And once again, left click to save that. We have discussed how to add and delete alert templates. If we have an alert that we want to delete, once again with that selected, left click on delete alert. We will close out of the alert template screen at this point. And now let's take a quick look at how these are tied in to monitors. Click on the monitors button and we will left click on internal monitors. Double click on a monitor. And you can see here in the alert config we're specifying which alert template we want to use. So I can select the desired alert template save and close that monitor. Now we have told this monitor to use that specific alert template. We can look at the same configurations on a system monitor. If I go back into the monitor screen and double click on the monitor, go to the alerting tab 
And once again, I can specify the alert template to be associated with this monitor in here. I'll make the change and save. The same configurations apply to network monitors. Double click and on the alerting tab, we can specify the alert template. This concludes LabTech Alert Templates Training.